everyone, this is Kate Schwinky, and today I have a review and packing video for the Lily Jade Elizabeth diaper bag, and this is going to be an all-in-one video. So I've actually been using this bag for a little over a week now, and I've been really enjoying it. I actually took it out this last weekend on a trip all the way down to Chattanooga, and it was an overnight trip, and it was really fun, and I was able to take the Lily Jade Elizabeth with me, and it was an absolute pleasure to take this bag out. I love this bag. And this has been one of my top favorite bags that I have ever owned. And it's also one of their fastest selling styles, which I can completely understand why. I absolutely love this bag. So this particular bag actually comes in five different color options. It comes in this beautiful camel color. It also comes in brandy leather, black leather, red canvas with camel trim, and navy canvas with brandy trim. And if you guys want to see the brandy color, I'll link my video for the Brandy Megan Diaper Bag by Lily Jade right here for you guys so you can see the difference. So the all leather Elizabeth diaper bags sell at $335 on the website and the canvas Elizabeth diaper bags retail at $215. But both styles are on sale on the website right now, so take advantage of that while you have a chance. And I'll leave Lily Jade's link to their store in the description below for you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and go over the outside details of this bag and show you guys all of the cool features and then I will show you how I pack it up. So this bag is actually made out of beautiful full grain leather and it's super, super soft and it smells amazing. I can never get over how wonderfully these smell and just how soft the leather is. It's super high quality. All their stitching and details on this bag are amazing. I love it. You also have these beautiful tote straps. They're a rolled tote strap and they're slightly squishy, um, just very soft. And as you can see, they're easily bendable. This can go over your shoulder or in the crook of your arm. When I use this bag, I prefer using these in the crook of my arm versus over the shoulder because I find the straps just a little short for me, but it's perfect for wearing in the crook of my arm. So I really like those. This bag also comes with a messenger strap that is included with this bag, and you can use that to wear this bag backpack style, shoulder style, or messenger style, which I think is amazing. As a lot of you guys know, I absolutely love convertible diaper bags, and that's one of the reasons this is one of my top favorite bags. And if you guys wanna see how this bag looks when it's worn, I'm going to be having an on the body video up later this week, so keep an eye out for that. This bag also comes with a removable insert that is machine washable, which is fantastic, and and it actually allows this bag to have more than 20 pockets inside of it, which is awesome. That is so handy for people who are like me that love to have their bags organized and have a place for everything. That is why I love the organizers that these bags come with. You also have two good size pockets on the front here, which I really, really love. It's like a saddlebag detail, and I think that is so classy looking and even timeless. I love them. And I will show you guys just a little bit up close. There's that beautiful silver logo on the front there. And as I mentioned, this bag has silver hardware. So these front pockets have magnetic snap closures. You can see there's a snap button there and they snap really well, keep this from flapping open. And it's like that on both sides. These pockets can hold way more than you think they can which is really great. And then you also have side bottle pockets, which actually hold more than I was expecting as well because the way the bag is shaped on the bottom here, you have a lot more space down here to put other things besides just a bottle. Like if you had a baby bottle in here and you wanted to put a little thing of formula down here, you could definitely fit that in there as well. So those are the side bottle pockets. They are non-elastic. They're just slip pockets, but they're great. I really like them. I also wanted to mention you do have a magnetic snap closure here, and it's actually a very nice deep pocket, and that is in the front of the bag. There is an identical one on the very back of the bag here. And you can keep a change pad back there if you wanted to, or other flat things I think that are really great to put on the back here. This is where your back is going to be against, so I suggest anything soft and squishy like a blanket or paperwork, or like I said, a change pad. That would be really great to keep your back comfortable back there. As you can see, I have my messenger strap anchored at the top of this D-ring here, and that's how I always carry this bag for the most part. I will use this as a backpack. And then I will also use this in the crook of my arm when I'm coming and going and just grabbing and going. So that is most of what the outside looks like. And I'm going to go ahead and start 
going through these pockets and showing you guys what I have inside. So in the very front pocket here, I have my cell phone and that is sideways in there. This is an iPhone 6. As you can see, it fits really, really great in there. It comes easily in and out. And that's not the only thing that I have in there, if that helps you see how big this pocket is. I also have down here a small set piece by Jujube, and that was actually sideways in there as well. And this just has some things for me in it. I have a folding hairbrush, some eye drops, some blotting wipes, a lip gloss, a little custom made mirror, a couple of hair ties, and I also have an EOS stick. That's all I had in this pocket over here. On this side, I have my keys. I like to keep them in there to keep them easy access for me. And that's all I have in that pocket. On this side here, as you guys saw before, I have a nine ounce swell bottle, and that fits great in here. Also the 17 ounce and even the 25 ounce would probably fit fine in here, no problem. That's all I had on that side. On this side, I have a few more items. I was able to actually fit quite a few items in here. I have three individually wrapped Neat Cheeks wipes for my boys. And if I didn't mention this already, this is actually packed up for both my boys. I have a two and a half year old and a five year old. So I have a little bottle of sunscreen in here. I have a little hand sanitizer spray. And I have one last thing. I just have a diaper baggie dispenser. That's all I had on the front and the sides of this bag. I don't have anything in this very front magnetic closure here. Um, I just got the bag way too full to be able to squeeze anything else in there. But I do have something in this back pocket here and I really love this item. And I'll actually be doing a review on it soon. But I have in here a change pad. And as I mentioned, this bag does come with its own change pad, but I really, really liked this one. Um, and it fits really great in this back pocket here. I wanted to show you guys that a change pad, if you wanted to use a different one, does fit in this back pocket here. This change pad is actually made by Se Petit Vienna, which is the same company that makes the Y pouches. So this is really cute. Can't wait to review this. So I have that in that back pocket there. And that completes what I have on the outside of the bag. So now let's go ahead and jump onto the inside. So this is what the top of the bag looks like. As you see, your rolled tote straps will kind of crisscross in front of each other, which I actually think is pretty cute. And it's easy to just separate them. And you have a nice long zipper across the top here. Everything's nice and smooth. So this is how I have the inside packed up. It's nice and organized. Everything has its own place. And this insert here is, like I said, completely removable. So if you don't want to have it in there and you want to have a lot more space to organize with pouches or you have something larger you want to put inside, like a fuel cell or a bunch box or something like that, you can. So the first thing I'm going to go through is this side pocket over here. I will take the insert out in just a little while and show you guys all the pockets on it. Uh, on the side here, there's a pocket that's good size and I have my play pack. This is a custom made play pack made by my friend Amanda. And in here I just have some play packs and stickers and crayons for my boys to play with if we're out and they get bored. So that was the first outside pocket. I'm going to go ahead and do all the outside pockets first before I go on to the inside. There's also two pockets um, right here. You probably can't see very well, but um, I only have one of them filled up and I have a small set piece in Black Magic by Jujubee. And in here I have just cords and charging cables and a power block for my phone. If it goes out and dies, I'll have something to charge it up with. On the other side, I have a custom made med kit made by Silly Stuff and Whatnot on Etsy. And in here I just have things like band-aids, Tylenol, ointment, things like that if there's a boo-boo and I have to fix it up. On the opposite side here, I have my wallet. This is a Kate Spade Kara wallet and it's just a half size wallet but it's actually pretty thick and this fits really, really great in this side pocket over there. On the back here, I don't have anything in this pocket over here, but over here I have my sunglasses and I have it in a Vera Bradley case that fits really great over there. So that's all that I had in the pockets on the outside. Now on the inside here, hopefully you can see, this is what it looks like and there are two good sized pockets on the inside part right here. 
And these two pockets are perfect for holding your wipes and your diapers. It's just the perfect size for that. So over here on the right, I have three size five diapers for my littlest. And right next to it, I have a custom made wipe pouch cover with my wipe pouch inside. And I love it, it's perfect, it holds all my wipes. That's all I had in those two pockets. I don't have anything in the little elastic bottle pockets on the insides here. There's also another smaller pocket right here and I have my son's baby aiders. These are his little sunglasses and these are awesome. I highly recommend these, I love them. And then there's an inside zipper pocket right here. And in here I have just a few things. I have a tissue holder. I have my NCO coin purse. And this holds insurance cards and punch cards. And then I have my gum. So that's all I have in this zipper pocket here. The last things that I have to go through are my JGB set pieces. I have a large set piece here in Donatella Sweet Shop. And in here I just have snacks and things for my boys. I have a couple of juices. Another one. I also have a fruit pouch. I have a granola bar. And a couple of fruit snacks. <laughs> And the last thing that I have is a medium set piece. And in here I have a change of clothes for my littlest. I have a little pair of socks. And then I have some shorts and a short sleeve top for him. So that is how I have the entire bag packed up. But now it's empty. You can see exactly how much space there is. And I'll go ahead and pull out this insert. It is magnetically attached to the side of the bag in here. So you can easily remove it. And actually, even when I'm just packing this bag up, I remove this and put everything in it before I put it back into the bag. And it's really easy to just grab and go. And you could even just change bags that way too if they happen to be the same size. So as I mentioned, this is the first pocket I started out with on the inside. It's a good size pocket. You have two, you have one over here and one over here. They're the same size. And on this side, you have four medium sized pockets. On the back, you have two larger deep pockets. On the inside here, these are the two pockets I said work really great with diapers and wipes. You have the zippered compartment back here, the one smaller foam pocket here, and two smaller elastic bottle pockets on the inside. And as I mentioned, this is 100% machine washable and it does come with a matching change pad. And this is actually a really great size for a newborn or younger babies, so I really like those. And now that I have it completely empty, that is what it looks like on the inside. It's beautiful. I really love this red color. It's a very nice, silky, smooth material. So if you were to remove the insert, this bag can easily turn into a purse. It's just such a great size for that. And it can also be easily turned into an overnight bag. I think this is just the cutest bag. And I think this would make an awesome little overnight trip bag or like carry-on or anything like that. It's just really cute for that and the size and shape are perfect. So on the inside here you have one more zippered pocket and it's a leather trimmed pocket with the Lily Jade logo there. This is a smaller pocket. I think you could probably fit your phone and maybe a couple other items in there. And on the opposite side you have a little bit of a larger slip pocket here and then another like phone size slip pocket there. And that is all there is to this bag, but it's so beautiful and I absolutely love it. So pretty, super functional, and I highly recommend this bag. If you liked this video or found it helpful, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching!